three, two, one, go! And as we start autonomous, we see Blue Alliance with the three cones they started with all in place in their grids. And Red, meanwhile, has already scored a total of five game pieces, although one has fallen from the upper row to the bottom. And while the Wild Hats dock and engage, looks like Cheesy Poops get a final cube scored in the middle row, and Central Circuits contribute to Cone. And although Blue Alliance's own autonomous contribution was certainly not too shabby, it is Red who starts Telly up with the lead, and they are quickly looking to add to it. Cheesy Poops coming over, dropping off a Cone in the middle row, and Citrus Circuits doing much the same. And while they race back from the loading zones, their alliance partners, Wild Hats, are coming back with a piece of their own. Ba back on Blue. They are still certainly staying in this match. Iron Claw dropping off the cone and Deus Ex Machina scoring as well. We see all three Blue Alliance robots and all three Red Alliance robots. It's like they're just running scoring cycles back and forth from their loading zones to their grids. And Iron Claw, speaking of, is coming back with the cone. They score it on the middle row for the Blue Alliance. 254, however, has already done the same for Red and their Alliance partners, Citrus Circus, dropping off another cone as well. And Cheesy Poof's already scoring again in the upper row, but Deus Ex Machina scoring in the middle for Red. And we are, for Blue, excuse me, and we are seeing some hard hits at the center of the field. So our robots trying to make their way past each other. In fact, even between Alliance partners. However, see Citrus Circus, they make it back. They add another cone to the upper row. And with a minute left to go, there are about 25 points separating our alliances. Red hoping to add to that. We see both Cheesy Poops and Citrus Circuits racing back as cubes this time, starting to work on filling out the bottom row. And Blue, meanwhile, has their entire middle row filled and soon to be their entire upper row, too, if Iron Clock has scored this cube. And it does stay in place. Blue Alliance has two rows entirely filled. However, Red is about to build the same feet as Wild has to drop off a cone. It does stay in place. Red has two of their own rows filled with 30 seconds left to go. We have about 30 points separating our teams. This one will come down to our end game scoring. It's like Wild Hats already waiting at Red's charging station while the rest of our teams try to eke out a final few game pieces. 20 seconds left, and we see DSX Machina onto the charging station for Blue, joined by Quicksilver, trying to leave some room for their alliance partner. On Red, meanwhile, Citrus Circus finding their way underneath Cheesy Poops, and Red gets all three of their robots ducked and engaged, and Blue gets their charging station balance as well. Both alliances finishing with three robots docked and engaged their lead and taking that match by a score of 190 to 179. And with that, congratulations to your finalists, Alliance 3, Team 604, 972, and 5171.